What's up everyone, Max here. So today we're gonna to talk about a mug. Well, not any mug, but Ember Ceramic Mug. Let's roll up that intro. Well, not that intro, sorry, this one. Alright, so this is gonna be a quick review regarding to this one. I've been using this for a month now. For that being said, I have some like and dislike regarding to this mug. First of all, this is one uh, one of the smallest mug I've ever seen. It's 10 oz. And the temperature you can control is between 50 to 62.5 degrees Celsius. What I like about this is actually when it maintains the temperature, it maintains really well. And also when you put the hot water inside, it does not get hot to the touch. Even you hold like this. That's about it for the good part. The bad part is the conductor right here. The conductor is exposed and those two rims right here acts as a conductor to connect with your coaster right here. So you can sit on, uh, you can have your mug sit on top and start charging it. Yes, that's perfect. But you have to let this dry before you put it on and charge it. Well, that leads to the second question. The better life of, uh, for this mug under regular use is 1.5 hours, while if you put on charge, it's about three hours. So every one and a half hour, you have to let it sit and start charging it for another three hours before it's full and start using it again. Unless you put it on the coaster and constantly charging it. Even so, the battery will slowly discharge it um, by 1% or 2% over an hour kind of thing. So um, if you do want to keep that running, you have to put on the coaster all the time. Or otherwise you will be looking at buying three of those um, to run through a day. Oh, another thing, the indicator right here, but the handle is on your left hand side. When I'm using the mouse, I'm staring at the screen. I just want to grab a cup of coffee using the left hand and drink like this. But the thing is, the indicator light indicates the temperature, indicates the battery life. When you flash in red, that means you have to put on charge. You don't get to see this. Other people get to see it. It doesn't make sense. I, I just wish it can be on this side so I can see it. At least I know it's time to put on charge. So for that being said, I love this mug. I hate this mug at the same time. Um, there's a lot of emotion put into this mug through a month of use. So I decided to put into video clip to illustrate how I feel about this cup with the joy and um, the anger and um, a disappointment with this mug. All right, so for that being said, let's watch that video clip.
right, that's it for the video. If you do like the video, hit the like button. If you don't like video, you know what to do. Hit that subscribe button and follow me on Twitter in the same time. If I have any questions, leave the comment below. I will definitely answer it for you, especially for this episode of the Ember Ceramic Mug. All right, that's it. Have a good day.